welcome back everybody to the CBP podcast. I'm your host Carter Buckets and this podcast is going to be dedicated to football cards in. I actually messed up on my news video. Apparently the rookies because of the corona are still in their college jerseys. That's a bummer to most people because we want to see Chase Young in his um, Redskins jersey. But it's also good for some people because score was in super, super high demand at first. And people, and maybe people can't find them at their local Targets or Walmarts. I know I can. So if you want, go to the Norman Moore, Oklahoma City even. Go to those Targets and Walmarts and stuff and you'll be able to get you a score box. But... That's not the case anymore with the new Prestige. Those suckers are sold out everywhere. Like I, how I said I'm going to be doing a video later tomorrow. No, I'm, I actually can't guys. I'm super sorry, but depends on the day I'm, I'm uploading this today or tomorrow. But I'm ordering them through shipping. So they're supposed to be here on Thursday, the 19th. So, I'll probably get a video done then. So, stay on the lookout for that. I'll hit you guys with daily updates. And, also, we have some more football card news. One of them being that Panini dropped one more draft thing. Like, but this contains only 20 cards looking for an autograph costing $10 or 20 bucks. I'm super sorry, but... In my opinion, that's a ripoff because if you want the rookies, you can literally j- you can open four score five dollar packs and you literally get the exact same amount of money and you get near double the c- no you get tri- quadruple the cards you get double the cards for fifteen dollars less. But also, there's no guaranteed autograph. In my opinion, I might buy them just for the content, but I'm. If I do, I'll give you my thoughts. But these Donruss, they come with 64 cards for 20 for 20 bucks, a guaranteed memorabilia card and um or an auto. So be on the lookout for that video. And also there's new basketball cards that dropped. They have Zion William, they have Zion on the cover. Be on the lookout for those if you're if you're a big NBA fan and you just want basketball instead of football. Other news, I don't, to be honest, I could not tell you when we're going to get the NFL players in their uniform, in the rookies in their uniforms. Because normally they release score, which they're never in high demand. I mean, I normally, like, before the virus, I normally went to Walmart and Target. I saw those. I mean, my local Walmart still has 2019 score boxes and stuff. So, for some reason, they were in such a high demand this year because, I mean, we have had sports cards. I think the latest they've been was um, when Zion was, like, in his rookie, like, at the beginning of the season, those were the earliest packs, so, I mean, and also for football, whenever, when you look at it, Panini, they got sold out, I mean, at my local Target, or, I went to my local Walmart one day, I could not, I tried looking for those suckers, they had just this, you know the box that they come in at Walmart where they store out the $10, the $20 and stuff? Yeah, they they had that out, and it was completely empty. So, that's how it's looking with these pristines, because, I mean, people with the with this corona do, really don't have anything to do, so. They're going to turn into being a pack guy, and then they're going to keep spending money because they love doing it. Then they'll get, and then they won't have much more money, so. If I was you, watch my review, see what I say about it. And if you want, go check out a few other card guys. If you 
but this is something. You won't always get good pulls, and you might always get good pulls. That's just your luck. Say you, I may get a good box rate whenever I get it on Thursday, but I'll probably be uploading something definitely on Monday, Tuesday, or Wednesday, or even Thursday. I know I'm uploading something on Thursday later or earlier because of that that box, but I have something coming in the mail I got for a pretty good stinking deal, so be on the lookout for that. And I think that's going to be all, but thank you guys for tuning in. This is the Quarter Buckets Podcast. Peace.